welcome back to the Preacher Plays. We've rearranged our cargo, and it all fits on there this time. I'm not really all that shocked. I just needed a little bit of better planning. Hello. This is this is what we're going to have to deal with. We're going to zoom out a little bit, and we're going to check the weather forecast, and it does not stop raining around here. That's just the way it is. Um, so I really need to get up to the weather station and get out of here, but there's probably going to be some BT area along the way as well. So let's get away from that. And I think more than anything else, what I need to do is try to figure out if there is a better way of getting where I want to go. And I think, I think if I can skirt most of the territory there, then I'll be a little bit better off. This is uh, going to take me a little bit of extra time, but um, but I think it'll be worth it. I think it will be worth it. We will try to make our way along the side here. And um, I'm not sure what that bridge is for if it crosses over here. I don't think that's what I want to do just yet, but we are going to try and make our way here and then, uh, then ultimately skirt up to here until we finally get back to the distribution center south. It's going to be quite the journey, but um, but it's a journey that has to be made. So we're going to start off, and Sam looks awful tired, and we are going to charge as soon as we step out. Oh, looky there. There is a charging unit right there. So that's where we're headed. <clears throat> So this will work out nicely. We'll let him get a full charge from Big Tobes. Make sure we drop some likes on that. Thanks, Sam. Weapons restrictions. Thanks for the help. This Give as many you. likes as we can on this. Yeah. This one's for you. Good job, Mr. Big Tobes. Yeah, we got a fully charged battery and. Uh, I don't know if I can carry much else. There's some ceramics here, so... Yeah, I see those black strands. That is the BT stuff, and I'd like to avoid that if I can. But uh, well, let's just see. Let's just see how this goes. I want to see, can I put anything else on that? I don't think I can. No, it's actually not going to let me. So we are, we are filled. We are filled. I probably should not be picking up too many more items here. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm, I'm going to say they put that particular quest together so I can find. Yeah, here we go. So I can find the um, racetrack stuff. And more ceramics. Yeah, so there are a lot of ceramics here not going to be going that route so also there is territory over there mules that's what I wanted I could dig out that word love to do some racing through this area but uh, ooh, you know what I need to do actually I'm going to have a drink of some stamina monster energy drink, whatever. Bridges energy drink. We've now finished the uh, the marketing campaign, I guess, with uh, monster. But you got to admit, it kind of fit in. So, <laughs> yeah, I'm hoping we don't run into BTs. I don't have a whole bunch of. I do have some grenades. And I think later on, uh, I'm, I'm actually close to an area where I'll be able to find, if I remember right, is it the costume maker? Is that is that who makes the uh, upgrades to your backpack and things like that? So, I don't know. So we'll see how that goes. Let's, let's pick that up. There we go. Yeah, we got, we're up to 3,000 again, so we're, we're, we're doing okay. Oh, uh, yes, I forgot about 
that waterfall. I have to climb around so that I don't have to deal with that big waterfall. And I'm not sure how to do it. This would be a great spot for some uh, ceramics down there. This would be a great spot for some music to kick in, but it's not kicking. Oh, man. Look at that. I could steal somebody's truck. That'd be fun. But, uh, but I don't want to get into BT territory or mule territory right now either. That would, uh, that would cut into my progress time. Look at that truck sitting over there waiting for me to get it, though. Oh, well. Maybe another time. I don't know if uh, this thing experiences much damage, but one of the things I do remember is a bridge right here. And I don't know if this bridge is always there or if people are building a bridge there, but the last time I played there was a bridge right here, and it was exactly when and where I needed it. Perfection save, right? Yeah, I just gotta... Well, I didn't mean to do that. Wow, look at that. How big was that one? That's, a big one. That's 124. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let those two go, even though I really want to run over there and get them. Throw some likes at that, that's for sure. We appreciate this bridge. All right. Now, I do not know. Fresh bread, huh? Well... I don't think I want to pick it up. Do I? Yeah, I do. I want to pick it all up. Just you, yourself, and me. That's all we got. That's all we got. There we go. I don't know why there's a please don't pee here sign. All right, fine, Jimkin. Container has been damaged. Whoop, 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 whoop. Close one. Now, let's go ahead and do a spray there. We'll go ahead and recover it. All right, that's good. Got that taken care of. I uh, can't exactly climb that. So let me let me see what I got here on a map. I can't climb this tower, and that looks like a pretty sketchy option. I could come around the side, and maybe that's what I need to do. Um, there's a lot of climbing there, and I've got some fragile stuff. What do we got going on for? Yeah. Well, maybe I should try to go around it. I don't know. We're going to do it. It may not be best, but it is what we're going to do. As long as we can avoid the very best of our ability. BT territory. You know, it almost looks like uh, stuff I see in North Dakota. Yeah, we'll we'll spray the stuff down here in a little bit. There we go. I kind of want to race, and I kind of want to not race, but, uh... There we go. All right. There is black strands there. Why am I... There we go. 
Yeah, there are black strands over there. I'd rather not have to navigate like this through BT territory. But it almost looks like I'm not going to have a choice. Yeah. Let's take a look at the map again just to see where I am. Yeah, this is this is pretty sketch. But we're gonna do our best. We're gonna do our best. Right here. Cargo container ruin. Well we're gonna have to re reapply a bit of spray to that here in a minute. I get to the top here, I think. Okay, okay. I think we're making the right directional choices now. Yeah, it looks like those are actually in the mountains. I kind of hope that we get past that soon. Oh, look at that down there. A bridge. Could be good, right? As long as we don't have to worry about. There we go. As long as we don't have to worry about the BTs, I'm going to be in good shape. Now, I think... What do we got here? Over this ridge. Uh, there's part of a well-worn path. Ooh, but, but I really don't want to be journeying through there because that is BT territory. And it's awfully rugged. Now there is a timefall shelter up here. I'd kind of like to go ahead and make my way to it. Don't know if I can. Take a look at the map here. And see... Yeah, it's over a couple of hills. We're going to kind of try make our way over to that time fault shelter. And, uh, I'm, I'm running low on battery. But, uh, thinking it'll be all right. Reserved in bog. Uh, sorry about this, Sam. There is. All right, here. There we go. Good. This is a good spot to be. And there's a motorbike down there, but we can't use the motorbike. Not with this current amount of stuff. But, this would be a great place to pause. And I kind of see a direction we're going to have to go. All of this stuff getting restored. That is really good. And I'll tell you what. Are we going to get out of this anytime soon? Hold on, let me see. In 20 minutes, it's going to be moving south. In 10 minutes, it's mostly north of us in 10 minutes. And in 20 minutes, we'll be able to get through some of it eventually. So let's pass some time. I don't know how much time I need to pass. Do I do that twice? Okay, i got to do it 10 more minutes. Damn rain went quick. 
No, it's not going to. Not from here. Rain's not that Screw now this. we're going to throw some lights Thanks and for go forward for here. You. Thank Thanks you, random dag. That is helpful. Let's all get out. Okay, good deal. Now let's see. I'm hoping that that rainbow didn't mean anything horrible for us. But we're going to find out. It's, I didn't repair those, did I? All right. Let's see if I can... I don't know if I can get through this or not very easily, huh? I love how this... Uh, Floating carrier does tend to make the job a little easier. I don't know how close we are to the edge of the rain nice. here, but I'm pretty interested in it. Oh, there we go. Well, that just changes the whole tenor of the trip. deal. Nice. Nice indeed. And I don't have much in the terms of battery power left. Yep, we hope so. We hope so. And the rain comes again. And the question is, can I get down from here? I have my sincere doubts. Can I do this on a... Oh, whoop, 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 whoop. Uh, hold on. This is not what I wanted to see. I have a theory, though. We're going to disconnect the carrier. All right, here's what we're going to have to do. We're going to have to go down and then come back for the stuff. Oh, boy. This is not what I was hoping for. All right, release the rope and then offload everything. Come on, can I get the rope? Grab the rope. And you're going to have to go back up. Yeah, this is this is where it gets really messy, isn't it? But I've got to come down off that cliff, and I think if I go over any further to where the cliff is shallower, there's most assuredly some, uh, we'll just say problems there. Don't don't fall, don't fall. There we go. We'll get it. There we go. Now, we're going to set this stuff over in a different pile, right here. All right, gently walk around that. Go right back up. <laughs> 
problem solving. That is the problem with carrying all that extra because you don't have the uh, capacity, I guess I should say. All right, let's go ahead and regret putting those on my back. Then, I'll just hit as many likes as I can on that. Very good. All right, let's do this. That's not what I intended. There we go. Now. Attach the carrier. Come on, set it on there. Slow. But we'll get it. All right, we're getting there. All right. Okay, good. Now, let's uh, go ahead and throw all these back on here and give everybody a nice heal. All right, I'm going to go ahead and use that one too on these. Yeah, it should be pretty good. Now, go ahead and I guess the one thing I didn't do very well was charge. I was going to use a PCC and charge me up here. So let me do this. Let that be for just a few seconds. 15 seconds to begin with. I kind of am going to need the, uh, the charge off of this. Construction nice. Very good. All right, let's hopefully I can get a couple of likes off of that. All right. Now, way over yonder, there is a... Hey. No, that's not what I want. Way over yonder, there is a road building thing. Hey. No. I want to see where... Is it that I'm looking at? Let's, can I remove all markers? Yes, thank you very much. And where is... Yeah, well, we're, we're headed pretty much straight there. So, let's go do it. Each one of these delivery quests... Especially once you've established a location for each of the nodes of the chiral network, um, they become kind of a challenge simply because you're trying to do them as efficiently as possible, and that might mean speed, that might mean protecting them from falling apart, and also might mean trying not to... Um, What's the word I want to say? Trying not to uh, break anything. So, you know, is it is it speed? Is it efficiency? Is it uh, the, the quality of the delivery itself? I mean, it's kind of all of the above. Almost wish that I could go over there and look at that. 
I don't want to cross the river if I don't have to. With that, especially, I just want to kind of see what are the metal requirements here. There we go. Um, well, we're looking at quite a bit, and I have quite a bit of that. Look at the chiral crystal requirements. Oh my goodness. Yeah, not 100% ready for that. So let's, we're going to move on. I really want to do the one that's just south of, uh, south of the uh, distribution center. But then again, I ought to be able to claim some materials from that distribution center. You know what? Actually, nope, nope, nope. We're going right back. We're going right back out of the water. I don't want to uh, cross the river right now. To the generator over there. Yeah, let's go ahead. And, there we go. We can pick up some speed. And I don't think the speed actually hurts the equipment at all. Biggie cheese. All right, Biggie. Thanks for the help. Yeah, we'll throw down some likes on that. And that is one of the road building things that I want to deal with. But I also want to take a drink. See, my stamina is falling. There we go. It's surprisingly, there has not been all that much in the way of missing uh, stuff. All right, Gusia, low roar. About to hit a pause here. Yep, pausing the music. Okay, good. <laughs> well, let's deal with what's on my back. Add that. And uh, we're going to go ahead and add that. Look at that is still not enough. Oh man. And I'm just gonna put in about half of that. Of 
There you go. Go ahead and get a full deal off with my equipment here. Good deal. Beginning scan. Scanning bridges ID. Verifying ID. Clear. Weapons detected. All weapons will be locked until departure. Cargo verified. Safe travels. Thank you. All right. Contaminating suit. All clear. Safe travels. Sam Porter Bridges. Good morning, Sam. Keep on keeping on. Well, we made it this far, didn't we? Let's make a delivery of lost cargo first. Okay, we'll let that go off to another player. Expert transporter, grade 60 on miscellaneous. Now we can do this. Everything all right, Zap? Looks good as new. Very good. Yeah, bridges have a jump ramp now. Okay, look forward to playing with that another time. Yeah, we got more bandwidth. That is good. And we have vehicle color data. That is nice. Hopefully we'll be able to get some trucks pretty soon. Those change the game as well. We got bots. Very good. And I'm now up to elite transporter. Good. Be harder for me to lose consciousness. That is nice. I haven't lost any yet. I'll take care of you. Oh yeah, I'm taken. I'm taken. Good work. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further information. Uh, racetrack terminal has been added to. Materials have been added to various things, and I am oh, curious. Mate. I'm actually curious to see if that. Road has been built yet. Yeah, it has not yet been built. And I know that it is. Where is that? Right there. What do I need? I need. I got more metals and crystals than I need, but I need about 100. Well, I don't need quite a hundred. I need 80 uh, or 60 ceramics. Hmm. Okay. Well, let me see if they got the ceramics here to give me. And we're going to see about doing that particular one. Play materials. Can I get any ceramics? We'll do that one. You bet. Carry it on my back. And yeah, that's good enough for now. I really want to get that road built. At least the road into here, and then we'll be able to uh, take care of the rest. I was kind of hoping somebody would finish building this road, but they haven't finished building it for me, so it's up to me to put that last 100 bit of uh, ceramics on there. And there is, over there I think is... There we go. See, that worked out nicely. All right. I'm going to try and take this bike because... Hey, isn't this the same one I left earlier? Hold on. Give me that.
There we go. <laughs> it's a little rough, but we can get it. And there's a reason why I wanted that bike, because I think that I can use it once we get this taken care of. This is my last little bit. We can build this part of the road. Yes. Rebuild with ceramics right there. Now we have everything. Build it up. And away it goes. Pretty good. I think. I think we now have road all the way up to uh, Fort Knot City, I think. Let's see. There we go. Oh yeah, this. This here is nice. How did that bike get on there, right? This is nice. This is exactly what I was hoping for. Good deal. All right, let's see what is happening here. And we're gonna see if we can go all the way up to Fort Knot City. Let's deliver some special fuel. So you may, I... Let's just skip the deal here, Thomas. Out. I'm taken. Good. Good work. New order available. Please access delivery. Deal. Take on orders. Let's see. To the junk dealer, not yet. To the film director, also not yet. Let's see what standard orders are. Something to the elder, to the craftsman, to the timefall farm. And I might want to take that one to Lake Nice City. I just kind of want to test the whole road. I want to enjoy the road that I've built. And we will do that one later. So here's what we're going to do. And less than 3% damage. Two pieces of cargo except the order. The jump ramp schematic has been added to your PCC. All right. These ramps harness the power of chiral crystals to propel you high into the air. Mm -hmm. You can use them while driving or on foot or even when riding a floating carrier. Okay. Try to remember that. I'm not planning on building any right now. Thank you so much. And uh, I'm going to take... You know what? I'm going to take that one. Because it's been good. It's ugly, but it works. Carry it on the back. Carry it on the back. And organize everything. Thank you very much. Not ready to head out yet, but I do want to... Hold on. I do want to look here at getting a couple of bots going. All right, let's deliver. Um, apparently, that's still being worked on. Let's send something down to the Timefall Farm. I like to take care of those differently, if I can. So let's send that one, and away it goes. Let's take these down the road. Let's enjoy a journey. Oh, yeah. Whoops. <laughs> I am apparently an amateur driver. It's all right. Batteries charge when you're on that center strip. That is nice. Oh, man. So, so good. BB likes the speed. That is good. I do too, BB. This is good. Someone is happy indeed. Hot diggity dog. Yeah, we'll have to do some 
upgrades and maintenance on the boat eventually because the time fall does wear it down, but it takes a while. The game has to regress for a while for that to be a real problem. Um, we will deal with that later. Because right now... Oh, there we go. Don't, don't forget to speed up when you're able to do it. Beautiful. I'd love to find myself a nice hilly patch or curvy patch of asphalt to take my bike on. But uh, not a lot of that here where I dwell in central Illinois. Most of the roads are just straight. Not a very interesting place to drive around. And it's Illinois, which means most of the hose, most of the roads are so riddled with potholes, you daren't try to enjoy yourself, so. Now, we are coming up on mule territory. They're gonna try and scan me. I hope, and I think, they won't be able to. I think they won't be able to. It's interesting how the road floats here above the mule territory. So. I don't know if that was to protect me from their uh, electric spears, but I like that part, if that's the case. Yeah, I've just been pinged. Good deal. Good deal, indeed. Haha. -ha. I outraced all of them, and that's the way I like it. Get to lower those barricades or I'm going to hit them. How fun. How fun. Didn't want to stop. There we go. All right. Let's do a quick turn in. Got those old books delivered. Hey, Sam. Good to see you. No, oh, I know it. The legend, everything looks to be in perfect condition. Thank That's because it is. You're welcome. Very good. All right. How fun is that? Yeah, that ought to get me. Until the next delivery, then. Stay safe. I think that next delivery is going to take a while. Good work. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further information. I can do that. Here's what's going to happen first. Let's see, do I got some stuff to recycle? I do. This. And that bullet gun is worn out. Those are worn out. That's virtually worn out. These are all, well, that one's almost gone. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get all new equipment next time. My skeleton is almost damaged. My boots are totally close to destruction. So there it is. We're going to go ahead and turn all of that back in. Yay, connecting the world. Okay. Well, here's what's going to happen. Thank you we for your contribution. I'm going to walk back over here without our boots on and enter our private room. That bike is going to get a nice paint job and get cleaned up. We like that. There it goes. It's in the garage and we are done. Let's skip that. And real quickly, let's take a look at some of the emails that we've got. Uh, okay, we've got stuff being done here. Let's take a look at these emails. Notice there's Timefall Porter on the table there for us, so that'll be interesting. Okay, uh, we don't have any standing orders. Oh, pesticides are ongoing, auto delivery. And mail. 
take back some time fall order i can do that best brew you'll ever drink according to the guy who made it so i've never known anybody who makes it to be shall i say humble have you been making use of that new odor deck feature we shared with you no no actually i have not but um you can analyze the soil and choose the best spots for growing wheat ours got lost in a terrorist attack on middle Lot city I definitely vouch for how useful it was be sure to give it a try if you haven't i will be doing that Craftsmen. Uh, Porters took down a BT the other day. A sharp drop in Carillium density that coincided with his report. So there's no denying he got him. So that is good. Um, keep giving us blood. He's asking for weather station as upgraded. Medical. Okay, I didn't realize he was medical. Posted here to keep an eye on our skeleton crew. Make sure their heads stayed right. Um, next best thing. We can collect data from all over. Good deal. You've got to find my cube, says Thomas. Northwest of the distro center, south of Lake Knot City. I've got to do some cube searching here in a little bit. The elder wants me to rebuild it. Uh, roads are getting better out there. Used to be highways and byways running everywhere. No more smart drugs for me. George is starting to uh, turn the corner and get better. Thanks for Igor's flag. Can't believe you brought me that loot. I go, you want Sam? You do. You owe me some things, and I plan on delivering and hit, catching up on that when I can. Focus on delivery time. Okay, yeah, I'll be working on time stuff later. Uh, bring me my time fall quarter. I think I already did that. Thomas wants to know if the bots are for the best. You can pause that if you really want to know, but I think that is all of that. The only other thing I've got to deal with is interviews. We are going to take a look at that real fast. I don't know. I'm going to speed read these and you can pause the data uh, and see if there's anything there that you really want to follow. I've read all of these, I think, before. I'm just looking to see if there's new stuff coming along. Prolonged exposure to chiral radiation. Emitted by Corellium, a substance discovered at the same time as the beach. Prolonged exposure can significantly impact physical and mental health. Okay. Hmm. Chiral contamination. Glycosin cannot be administered externally. It's secreted within the body. Okay. All right. Beaches and the concept of death. And I'm not going to read all of this, but essentially within the game, the beaches is this... Uh, this aspect of our connection to the afterlife. And uh, maybe we'll, we'll deal with some more of that later, but we've had so many interviews coming in that I'm just going to browse through these real quick and you can pause if you want to read them all. Evolutionary developmental biology. We're going to deal with some of that later when we catch up with Hartman and some of the people around him. Um, reproduce complete forms. Okay. Higgs boson particles. Okay, without it, atoms would fly apart. Matter would not exist as we know it. Chiral clouds and time fall. So that is more of that. And I don't know. Yeah. Lots of evolutionary stuff here. Thinking that the BTs are reaching out to us. Maybe they are. Maybe they're just trying to kill us. Uh, light we see was produced a long, long, long time ago. And this is what they're talking about. You route the data through the beach, and uh, you can make everything you're trying to do shorter and faster. So there we go. Uh, according to Fragile, we once had a network spanning the whole wide world that could send items from anywhere to anywhere and connect anyone with anything. But still we were isolated. Still we were alone. And uh, the shelters of the preppers became their homes where they would live and die. There you go. Time fall and power failures. The clouds themselves are a big tell, and inverse rainbows are guarantee you're in for some crap. But there are smaller signs too. Changes in the air, a smell on the wind. When it hits, you've got power outages to deal with, and all of those things. Okay. We'll deal with that. When I first laid eyes on the lake here at Ground Zero, I was blown away by the sheer size of it. I never imagined anything could be so huge. This was just after the Death Stranding, and not many people had seen the craters up close yet. 
an explosion like nothing the world had seen before tore a gaping hole in the heart of America. Well, in an antimatter explosion, which is what these are being described as, that would do that. It would do that. Oxytocin. Docs will tell you oxy's the thing. And this is just a couple of quick interviews from some of the preppers. Uh, transporting weapons. Time fall farmers. And we will deal with the on man, unknown man's journal the next time. I think that's going to be an interesting entry. Porter's note number one to our beloved daughter. Hope your chance to read this one day, an unidentified porter. Uh, just traveling world. To kind of get a few a feeling of what that is like. Five years isn't enough time to get your bearings, much less live a life. You're the only one I could save. You could only dig graves for the others, and then for you in the end. Dig and grieve and try to make amends. All that's left of me is her. My daughter, my sole remaining glimmer of hope. Our future may be broken, but it's not beyond repair. Futures are fragile, but my daughter is made of stronger stuff. All right. Well, we have caught up with all of that. I do hope even more of that comes in. I do hope that you are enjoying Death Stranding Director's Cut. We will deal more of it, deal with more of it the next time. But until then, I really just hope that you'll come back and I'll see you again.